hello friends welcome to my channel this is Charan in this video I will show you using AngularJS how to bind JSON data into a HTML table I'm using notepad plus plus for this example and in this notepad plus plus contains a simple HTML5 code with header tags h1 and h2 let's save this file before writing the AngularJS script we'll check the output how it looks the designing path on the browser and this is the output of that code which contains header tags h1 and h2 let's switch over to the notepad plus plus we'll add the angular.js script with json data and we'll bind into the html table and back to the notepad plus plus after the title tags i'm adding script i'm closing script between the script I'm declaring where my app is equals to angular dot module my app my app dot I'm creating a controller between double quotes the first parameter is a JSON data and the second one it creates a function dollar scope I'm closing the controller dollar scope dot students is equals to Between square brackets, I am adding JSON data. The data is this is a JSON data I want to bind into HTML table. Let's copy this one. I'm pasting here. We have just finished the Angular script. Now we need to create the table in the body. For that, I'm adding table border is equals to one I'm closing the table I'm adding caption H3 Closing the H3 student table T head closing the T head table headers TR closing the TR TH closing the TH the table address are student ID, this one, copy this, this here. I have four columns, student ID, first name, last name and age. The first name copy it, this here, last name copy it and the final one is the age after adding headers now I'm creating T body closing the T body TR closing the TR I'm adding TDs closing the TD the columns, the student, these four columns I want to display in this 3D. So, copy, paste, paste, paste. Now, the main part we need to bind this Angular script into this table. For that, in this div, I'm adding ng iPhone app is equals to my app.
and as well as I'm declaring the ng controller director also. The controller name is JSON data. Yes, here. Once I added ng iPhone app and ng controller directors to this div, uh, the whole div is belongs to this AngularJS script. Come to the bottom. The tr ng iPhone repeat is equals to student in this one students paste here now I can access the columns using the AngularJS expressions student dot the column name is a student ID this one paste here student dot first name student dot last name student dot the last one is the age That's it, we have just binded the AngularJS script into this HTML table. But to run this AngularJS application on a browser properly, we need to add the latest AngularJS CDN link, which is I'm adding here this one. Let's save this file. We'll check the output. This student's JSON data is binded in this table or not. I'm reloading the browser. And here we got the results. The JSON data is added to the HTML table. That's it. If you like this video, please leave your valuable comment, share this video, and please subscribe my channel. Catch you on my upcoming videos.